In addition to text, images, and videos, the Venus Control Suite web editor tool has the capability of adding in date, time, and temperature fields. Every display has the capability of displaying date and time. In order to display the temperature, you need to make sure you have a temp sensor attached to your display. From the web editor tool, if you click the clock icon up at the top, you can add in date, time, or temperature fields, as well as a countdown. The countdown feature is discussed in a separate video. If we select the date, time, or temperature field, you can choose we have all of our different options there, date, time, temperature, or a user-defined section. If we open up our date section, we then have the option of what format we want that date to show up as. Keep in mind the date that you choose in here will be a placeholder in the Venus Control Suite software. This placeholder will show up everywhere in the software, including on the dashboard page. So if it doesn't look like the correct date in the Venus Control Suite software, that's okay. It will display the correct date on your actual display. If you're adding in time, you have the option to choose from a 12 hour format as well as a 24 hour format. Just like with date, that will also show up as a placeholder in the software. If you're adding in temperature, you have the option to add in Fahrenheit or Celsius. And just like with date and time, that will also be a placeholder in the software. Under the user defined section, you have the option to add in a custom date and time format. This might be useful if you want to display the date in the international format, which would be year, month, and day. You'll notice when we added in those fields, it also added in this empty field in between them. This is a separator. If we click the drop down there, we can choose how we want that to be separated, whether it be a slash, a dash, a period, a comma, a semicolon, or just space. Additionally, with all of the fields you add in up here, if you click on any of those, you'll have different options for how you want that format to show up. Once you've selected your date, time, temperature, and or user defined sections, you can click set and it will add that field into here. Just like with any standard text box, you can make adjustments under the font section for how you want that text to be displayed.